Mahina. This is your Thursday thrill for the daily belly dance cookies. Today we have a veil combination. So we're going to start out with our veil behind us and go ahead and make sure you have an appropriate length on your grasp so that your veil is not either drooping down like this or too tight across your back. So we're going to start out with a swoop on the right hand side. So we're going to step. I have my veil anchored at the small of my back and I'm swooping out this way and step and I'm going to swoop out this way. I'm going to take my veil around in a four counts, two, three, four. Now my veil is in front of me. I want it just below my chest line because we're going to do some arm and some chest things here and I want them to be seen. So I'm going to have right arm, left arm, vertical chest circle, right arm, left arm. I'm going to dip down. I'm going to take my body when I dip down and I'm going to bend at the hips like this and take my gaze down just a little bit to emphasize the down because then we're going to contrast that with the up. So I'm going to come down here and I'm going to come up like this. So if I brought my left knee up, you can also come onto releve when you do that if you like. We're going to come forward with the basic Egyptian. We have step, touch, step, touch, step, touch. On the fourth one, we're going to turn ourselves profile, step, touch, but we're also going to scoop the veil right here. And that happens at the same time as the foot. So I'll do that section for you again. There's eight counts there. We just came from, let's do this part again too, from down and up like this, okay? So we have step, touch, step, touch, step, touch, step, scoop. I'm gonna step back with my left foot and I've kind of got my veil underlining my eyes here back on my right, and then I'm going to open my veil up like this, but at the same time I'm going to be doing a walking hip circle. So what's going on underneath of this is one, two, three, and I'm going to turn on that left foot and flip to the back. What's going to be happening with my arm as I do that is I'm going to be opening it out, and as I make that flip, I'm going to unscoop my veil like this. So let me do that together for you here. Okay. So I have one, two, three, and flip like that. Okay, so let's go through the whole thing one more time without music. So veil at the back and check your length of your grip. So starting out with a swoop on the right. Step, swoop, step, swoop, go around, two, three, Four, arm, arm, chest, down, lift, step, touch, step, touch, step, touch, step, swoop. In two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, ready? Here we go. On the swoop. Step, swoop, step, swoop, around, two, three, four, roll, roll, circle, and come down, lift up, step, touch, step, touch, step, touch, step, scoop, come back, two, three, four, and open, two, three, unscoop. week. So there's some nice little elements in there um, with the scooping and unscooping on the turn, which are nice flourishes to use in accents of music for your choreography. And also, especially here, here, and coming up. This can be done a couple of ways. You can do this without the knee, of course. You can do this just coming up like this. You can take it up on the knee, and you can also take it up on releve. But however you do that, do go ahead and look up just a little bit because it emphasizes what's going on with the veil and it makes it very beautiful and gives it a nice light and open quality. So, so that's what I have for you this week and I'll see you all next week and I will see you in Los Angeles very soon. And uh, if you're looking for other dates, go ahead and check my website and you can find them all right there. Have a wonderful week. See you next time, bye.